Our final stop for a month-long journey across Vietnam was Ha Tien, a sleepy seaside town near the Cambodian border. We got a room at the nearly empty Hai Yen Hotel, where we had a nice view. Two beds, way more furniture and space than we needed, and a balcony, all for just 15 bucks a night. After checking in, we took a walk around down by the water. There really isn't much going on here at all, but there are a few cheap restaurants and even a tourist info spot. In search of some comfort food, we happened upon the Oasis Bar for breakfast. Iced coffee, mango juice, and a full English breakfast was just what we needed. There's a beach here, and although it's not going to win any awards, it's certainly nice enough for a few hours. Drop into a beachside restaurant if you're looking for some more delicious Vietnamese coffee. At first, it seemed like we were the only ones who actually wanted to sit on the beach. Eventually, a few locals came out as well, and naturally, they wanted to take photos with us. After a crazy trip across the country, it was nice to chill out a bit. With some hired motorbike drivers, you can go out and explore the area a bit. The most interesting thing to see here is the Dak Dong Cave Pagoda. Walk up the stairs and head in to explore this Buddhist temple in a cave. It's full of altars and funerary tablets and makes for an interesting stop in an otherwise boring town. also home to plenty of bats. And you'll get great views through a few openings. There's one more stop, and then it's on to Cambodia.